Well, Singapore's semiconductor industry is getting a boost with its first ever facility to manufacture what's called advanced substrates as a key part of chips making. The plant will be set up by Topan, that's a Japanese printing technologies company. The Economic Development Board says it will spur R&D efforts and create new jobs. Rebecca Mateo tells us more. In two years' time, a new manufacturing plant will sit at the site near the Jurong Lake district. The three-storey building will occupy some 95,000 square metres of space. It's Topan's first manufacturing facility outside Japan that aims to be more advanced and serve as a second production source. The company will be producing advanced substrates like these, which can be used in high-end semiconductor products like those powering artificial intelligence and machine learning. While the firm declined to reveal the investment amount, Japanese media reports say the facility costs about 450 million Singapore dollars. This facility will also create new jobs for Singapore. The company plans to employ some 200 high-tech engineers and skilled technicians. They will get to learn and lead in this field of substrates, manufacturing and development. The plant will be jointly invested by Topan and its biggest client, US tech giant Broadcom, which already has a presence in Singapore. Broadcom says the facility will produce more complex and higher quality chips it needs to propel its next phase of growth, and that is attracted to the political and economic stability here. Having the ability to build a substrate here in Singapore and being able to package it all in the same place will reduce my cycle time, which is my lead time to my customers, but also it actually reduces the cost of moving these units from different places in Asia, which is not inexpensive at this point in time. EDB adds that this is a valuable addition to the local semiconductor ecosystem and will allow Singapore to move into high growth areas such as AI and advanced data centres. Customers that would be using such products uh, would also benefit from having such a plant here in Singapore. Uh, in addition, uh, Singapore is a critical node in the global semiconductor value chain. And hence, uh, having such a plant will continue to add and strengthen uh, Singapore's global position for this. It adds that this is one of Japan's largest investments overseas in the past decade for a key component in the semiconductor supply chain and that EDB remains keen to partner with more semiconductor companies globally across the value chain.